This is KMTV 3 News Now. Hi, I'm Craig DeGrelli with 3 News Now. Here's what's happening. With more rain on the way and lots of standing water in some places, concerns about West Nile virus are growing. So far, six people have died from the mosquito-borne illness in Nebraska this year. One of those deaths was in Douglas County. County health officials urge people outdoors to protect themselves. Researchers have collected almost three times as many mosquitoes as last year. More than half are the breed which can carry West Nile virus. People who live in Ralston will soon pay higher property taxes. There will also be cuts to city departments. The city council approved a $23 million budget on Tuesday. $4 million will go toward the debt at the Ralston Arena. The council also eliminated a vacant position in the Ralston Police Department. And on 3 News Now, weather alert meteorologist Jennifer Zeppelin with this latest weather update. It was a hot day today with an afternoon high temperature of 91 degrees. Looks like one more really warm day across the area before a cold front makes its move. As we go into the overnight hours, a few clouds around, still dry conditions, partly cloudy with a morning low on Thursday of 73 degrees. Now the wind speeds will also be picking up. Could see some gusts close to 30 miles an hour on Thursday in advance of a cold front moving in. Once that front moves in by the late evening hours. We're expecting some widespread rainfall, possibly some strong storms and maybe a couple of isolated severe storms. We've got an 80% chance of rain, 89 for the afternoon high. Once it moves through, it turns drier on Friday, 67 up to 72 on Saturday. Officially fall begins at 854 in the evening and it will feel a lot more like fall morning low Saturday of 46 degrees. We'll continue the 70s into Sunday, but by early next week, we're tracking more rain with highs in the 60s and 70s.